Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be doing the Charlotte York from Sex and the City look, and I'm just going to be a remake because I didn't like the other one, it wasn't very good quality. Um, I hope the lighting is a little bit better here. Um, so, I already put foundation and concealer on my face. I just used MAC's um, Studio Fix Fluid SPF 15 in NW18, and Wet n Wild's Coverall Concealer, and we're going to be using this again in just a few minutes. So, what I'm going to be taking is any bronzer that you have, it does not matter just as long as you have your ordinary bronzer and you just wanna go on your forehead in a three motion forehead, cheek, and jawline don't forget the jawline. You recommended you can use a kabuki brush or bronzer brush, but since I don't have one on me today, I'm using an ordinary blush brush. Because I'm not, like, really, uh, I can't really invest on a, any brushes right now. So. Okay, so once you've got that, want to take a, the concealer again, any concealer that you have. And this one is by Wet n Wild and it's in 802. Just take some on your finger. And this is just going to be used as a base. Because I'm not going to be using my shade stick because I figured it's way too dark. But just because Charlotte doesn't wear that much colors anyway. So we're just going to be going very natural. And it's very hard to see what she wears. You shouldn't really see anything, it's just a concealer, so it should blend in. Okay, so once you've got that, we're going to be taking eyeshadow, so we're only using one color today. I'm going to be using my Lancome brush, and I'm going to be taking this color right here. Now my palette broke, that's why it's, it's difficult and the bronzer broke, so I'm just going to be using this one right here. Hmm. Oh, this is going to be difficult. This one right here, this light brown. Hope you can see. And we're taking that brown. It's a very neutral color, very simple. Just going to put it all over your eyelid. I love the show actually. I've only seen the season one, two, three, and then the first movie. And I think the second movie, but I didn't see fourth and fifth season. I think they have a sixth season, maybe. So I like those. I love the fashions, it's absolutely amazing. It shouldn't take too long. Just trying to even it out. Okay, so once you've got the eyeshadow, you want to take a blush. I'm just going in random order. I'm going to be using a coral blush. This is by Cyber Colors and it's number 10. No, we're not going to be using this brush. Let's use a smaller cheek brush, which is also by Lancome. It's very small because we're not going to be covering the whole area. Just going to go on top. Just like that. Don't want to go on the apples or anything like that. Just on the top of the cheekbone. I hope you can see. Mm. Okay, so once you've got that on, we're going to be taking an eyeliner. You want to take any black pencil eyeliner. This one is, in this case, by e.l.f. Shimmer Eyeliner Pencil, and it's it's black, obviously. And the cool thing is, is that this actually comes with the sharpener, so if you're on the run, you can get this and just, you know, sharpen it. So you don't want to make this all thick and weird. You just want to... This is a very subtle look, so you want to make it very, very thin and very natural, as if you're not wearing any eyeliner. So what you're going to do is, you want to just tease the hairs of your eyelashes. 
Oh my gosh. This is so difficult. Maybe if I do something like this. See, it's very difficult to do it this way. Maybe. See what I mean? You need to make a very thin line. You can't really make it thick at all. So you just also want to go... Hold on. Okay, then you want to go on the lower lash line. You want to line all the way in this time. Like that. Oh my gosh, this light is horrible. I am so sorry. So that should be what you get. It's very simple. It's a very nice everyday look. Now, you don't have to do this, but for me, since I'm wearing this out today, I usually redefine my brows. Um, even though my eyebrows are naturally dark and thick, I still need defining. So I'm just going to take any dark brown, for me, at least for me, I'm taking a dark brown eyeshadow. And I'm just filling in my brows from with an angled eyeliner brush. Those are my brows. I just need some defining. It does look darker on camera, but honestly, it's not as dark as it looks. I will take you in the light when I'm finished. Just want to groom them in. Now, what else are we going to do? Oh yes, we're going to be taking MAC Plush Lash, or use any mascara that you have. We're going to take, if you have MAC Plush Lash, you want to keep the flat side to yourself, onto your lashes. Strange, doesn't it look when you're in the camera, too, when you're head back? It looks silly. But how you get good results afterwards? Bottom lashes are optional, you don't have to. I usually don't, so I'm not going to put them on. Okay, so once you've got that, we're just going to finish off with the lips. Okay, so... Yes, I'm going to be taking my Victoria's Secret palette. And we're going to be using this color right here. This one right here. It's a pretty nice dark pink. This one. And I'm just going to use my finger. 
I'm not that much of a freak for using brushes, to be honest. If I'm doing someone else's makeup, then yeah, but I usually don't like to use brushes on my lips. Even though I did hear, hear that it does last longer with a brush. But who cares? And then we're going to be layering on top of this. So we're, last step is we're going to take... Um, 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 um. Where's my lip brush for this one? Okay, so take any lip brush that you have. We're going to be taking this one right here. This one, it's sparkly red. It's like a brick red, sparkly. And just want to take some and put it on the center of your lips. Just a hint of color, I guess. Mix it in. You don't want too much. And then there you have it. Charlotte York. Take you in the light. So this is what it looks like totally. It's very natural. It's very pretty. And I hope you guys enjoyed this look. So tell me what you guys think. See, it's one color and very natural lines. So I hope you guys enjoyed this look. So thanks for watching, guys. Bye. Okay, bye.